So I haven't, uh, I haven't posted anything for a while, but I've been watching, uh, and the reason it's taken me a while to post something is because, uh, because of this, um, I just don't even know where to begin, uh, there's so, so many, uh, there's so many different, um, I'm confused, um, there's, uh, there's so, there's so much, uh, there's so much going on with this, uh, philosophical YouTube community, um, that it seems almost it seems almost hard to to compress it all down into into something um, into some sort of system of classifications that we can use to make sense of it all at once and there's a lot of topics being discussed a whole lot of talk a lot of talk long videos lots of words um, There was a time when I was writing, um, I write essays, I write a lot of poetic prose and things like that, and there was a time, um, where when I did that, I, I was so verbose and so, um, uh, wordy, uh, just, uh, just, um, using, uh, using the, the most, um, uh, just using a style of speech uh, that I that I felt um, I was trying to point at, a, at some concept as precisely as possible. So I wanted to use as many words and um, as I could and rule out this way that you could take it and rule out that way and, say, and point at exactly what it is that I wanted um, to communicate because I had a I had a thing that I wanted to communicate. It was a thing, uh, and it was a concept. It, it was it was content. It was um, uh, there was philosophy going on in my mind. There is, or maybe there was emotional um, happening. Uh, maybe uh, maybe there was something else, some other form of idea. Whatever it was, though, I paid attention to the content. So when my mind was doing something called philosophizing, the reason I needed to use so many words and point at something so exact was because I was so obsessed with the content of the process philosophizing. So, I mean, when I, when I do philosophizing, I can have anything. And, uh, I mean, I could be... Um, doing, uh, oh, what's one I used to, I, uh, uh, I could be doing, um, is evolution, uh, uh, likely, um, to be the way that things came to be, or, um, is intelligent design even a plausible theory, or could the two be integrated, where one is the answer, to uh, how and the other is the answer to why. Um, well, that's philosophizing, but I w was paying attention to whatever the issue was. Maybe it was abortion. Who cares? I was paying attention to the issue, and so because of that, I needed to point at something so so exact because I didn't want I didn't want anybody to miss exactly we were all doing philosophizing and I, I wanted people to see this is the thing that I'm philosophizing about and that's the one that I'm not and this is one the one that I'm not and here's the one that that I am and that's what it is but um, after a while I got really really fucking tired of doing that and now it looks a little different.
I'm not focused on the content of my mind. I'm focused on the process that it's running. So when I'm feeling an emotion, where in the past I might have sat down and tried to write a paper about I'm sad, and it's not um, sad in a feeling like a victim way, but sad in a compassionate, um, uh, yet somehow apathetic, pointing at it so specifically where now if I was to write that paper, um, I wouldn't even be aware of whether or not I was sad or ha I would be aware that I was running emotion. Um, similarly, I'm more apt to write about the process of philosophizing and what it is that brings that about than I am to write about any particular issue. Um, I, I mean, I could do that all day. Uh, I, you know, I, if there's a philosophical problem that exists and two reasonable people can argue either side, then the process itself is what needs to be watched because it's obviously creating um, delusions, uh, false dichotomies. God, I, uh, again, false dichotomies.